yeah the eyebrows are done and with the eyeshadow i'm starting with a dark purple on the james Charles morphe palette and blending it out with a lighter purple on the same palette I drew my cut piece using the All Ego Pro Concealer. And on my crease, I apply the blue shimmer on the Gems Charles Morphe palette. And before I go any further, uh, in today's makeup, basically, it's mermaid skin concept. Yeah, so I'm trying to blend out my crease in the other corner. Using the dark purple on the James Charles Morphe palette. Yeah, now the eyeshadow is done. Okay, on this other eye. With that done, um, I'm going to go in with my cosmetics NW46 Studio Fix Foundation. Let's blend it in. To highlight parts of my face, some parts of my face, I'm going to use the Eco Blue Concealer. For my nose contour, I use the light purple shade of the James Charles Morphe palette. To set my concealer, I use Kylie Cosmetics Translucent Loose Powder. Uh, guys, um, to create the curls, I'm going to first wear this body net on my face. Yes, right. To apply um, shimmer eyeshadow, I first apply the dark purple shimmer um, on the BH Take Me Back to Brazil um, Rio Edition palette. Then to kind of blend it out and highlighting to create some definition, I use the blue shimmer on the same palette. The BH take me back to Brazil and the Rio Edition. With that done, I'm going to first uh, go in with um, a maroon lip liner. And then blend in a blue liner by Kylie Cosmetics Lip Liners. I apply some highlight to make it pop. And I first apply pink and blue concealer for my eyes shadow on the neck and close to my shoulder. I use the blue shimmer from the 35 Vista Universe. Of excess powder money. Of course.
first more artwork on the lower eyelid to make it kind of smoky eye. I added a blue shimmer from the, um, the Jim Charles Murphy palette to create kind of a blue liner and then I highlighted my inner corners of the eye using the Makeup Evolution um, highlighter palette and I applied mascara using a uh, false lash effect mascara. I set everything using the MAC Cosmetics Makeup Fix. Then I highlighted my edges using the Melkup Revolution Highlighter Palette. So I tried on this curly wig first but um, it didn't match with my makeup and I changed with a hair extension and you can see, hell no, hell yay! <laughs> um, my natural hair is not relaxed or straightened I guess, um, you can spot the difference uh, between my, you see, my hair and the ex extension itself but let's just go with it. This is the finished look. Comment to tell me what you think about it. And thanks, thanks for watching. If you watch until the end, um, if you're new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell to not miss out on other JC uploads ever, ever, ever again. <laughs>